Have you noticed that video content marketing has taken over social media? I mean, everywhere I look, it's just video content between TikTok, Reels, even Twitter. Everything is video content and it seems that social media is moving more towards moving images than still images. Today's video is all about learning how to drive traffic using video to skyrocket your business to exactly the place you want it to land. And of course, using videos to promote your business and make money. If you are new here, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe so that you can keep seeing more tips and tricks on all our videos to come. And of course, make sure to check out our other social media sites that include Instagram, TikTok, and YouTube, and of course, our website. Video is the most engaging form of content because it is triggering all of our senses. Sound, visual, and of course, that connection that comes with the person that's in front of the camera. And of course, it's also engaging us for longer periods of times. With a photo or with a scroll on Instagram, you see a photo, you tend to just scroll really quickly. But with a video, you're going to watch at least 10 seconds of it. And whether you click it or not, you did engage for it longer. Currently, 81% of businesses are relying on video content to promote their business and increase their rates of audiences and sales. Another fun fact is that Google and other search engines are pushing video content because so many people are interacting with it. And at the end of the day, what we've learned about the algorithm is that if you're staying on the app longer, they're gonna keep pushing out that content that's making that person stay longer on the app. So we'll be going through different types of videos to start driving in some traffic with video content. The first type of video that really gets the audience going is storytelling videos. I mean, how many true crime podcasts and YouTube videos are out there that each video is about an hour to two hours long? There are people that sit through both hours and really absorb every single piece of information they're saying. At the end of the day, trying to apply that to a business is genius because really trying to grasp the audience's attention is crucial, but it's doable. And of course, you really want to stretch that emotional muscle when it comes to storytelling, especially if your brand has a backstory. Let's say that your brand has a tie to your grandfather. At the end of the day, telling your audience about that is crucial and it will help them connect with your brand more and connect with what you're trying to sell to your audience. And of course, storytelling is a great way to launch your business, especially if you're a new business in town. Doing this will help create a surface level clientele base that can potentially expand your business in the future. The second type of video that you can use to promote your business is educational content. I mean, many viewers just want their problem to be solved. And if you can solve that problem, they'll be coming back to your page and keep wanting more content. Especially videos that we do on this channel, showing people how to market their social media and to take their social media to the next level and expand their business and skyrocket their sales. At the end of the day, what we're doing here is finding a solution to someone's problem and that will increase the growth of your channel, your page, your TikTok, you name it. You might think that it's unnecessary because you think that everyone's satisfied with the product, everyone's satisfied with your page, but at the end of the day, let's say that you have a skincare product. Don't be shy, do a demo reel, like on Instagram. And at the end of the day, showing them how to use the product will go so much farther than you think it would. Not only is it gonna be you in the video, raw, unfiltered, just your iPhone setup, 
it's gonna be that less showing how to use your product. So they'll feel informed and more equipped so that they're more inclined to buy the product because they know how to use it properly. The next type of video is a demonstrational video. I mean, for years, cooking channels have been the rage. And it's because they're demonstrating a task and demonstrating how to complete something. At the end of the day, customers are driven in by that. Being able to learn something while also having a form of entertainment is priceless. And of course, since they're extremely visual, let's say you're watching a tutorial on how to wash your hair properly, seeing those videos and seeing those people demonstrate that task will help you have more clarity, get you excited about what you're trying because of that video. And of course, including testimonials of clients' personal experience with the product can really help aid a lot. Especially if from one client to another, it's great to see that the individual is doing what they need to do in order to grab the attention of their audience. And the next one is informational videos. At the end of the day, videos that just provide common information can get the audience excited depending on who's watching. At the end of the day, just informing the reviews, informing your audience about the testimonials, and informing your audience about your social media pages, just informing them is enough to get them searching and to get them curious about what you're trying to provide within your company. At the end of all this, I just want to say that video content marketing is super important and it's where the future is headed. Video content can be tedious, can be a lot to edit, and sometimes can be a lot to handle, but let me tell you, it's worth it. At the end of the day, on Google's free times, they want to be just fed videos. And it's proven that that's exactly what's successful. So if your business hasn't used video content marketing as a strategy, they should seriously consider it because it's a one worth while. Thank you so much for watching. I really hope that really diving into the kinds of content marketing videos that you can make really helps you understand what you're putting yourself into and what kind of videos will target that niche audience that you've been trying to chime into. Please don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe so that you can see more upcoming videos in the future. We hope to see you in the next video. Thank you so much and have a great day.